Hey Gemini, welcome to your singles reading. If you're new, welcome. Please remember to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you get all the messages I post each month. To my lovely loyal subscribers, welcome back guys. I'll leave information regarding what decks of cards I use and how to contact me for personal readings during the description. Uh, sorry, I was looking for a card flipped over. Um, I'll leave my information in the description box okay guys so let's see okay there it is <laughs> um eight of swords reverse so although you're single some you are heavily on somebody's mind here um i feel like they're almost scared to make a move with that eight of swords reverse though because it's like they're slipping into some sort of depression or it's like sleeping on something here going on so let's see Let's see. Let's not just presume it. Let's get the cards and find out. Eight of Wands. It's like if they just reached out, then they would, there'd be no problem. You'd know they like you. You could flirt back. Um, the Four of Swords. Uh, they have spent some time healing from a connection, and this is why uh, they're holding back. They're scared of being hurt again here. The Star. But you're destined to meet, so it's okay. The Divine will arrange the meeting um, because this person's, is thinking about you a lot but scared to reach out um they're scared of being hurt before you've even got into a relationship because they see you as this person that's just carefree and beautiful here and you may be but it's not that you've never had any problems in your life right you just might be this beautiful carefree energy that everybody's attracted to um very fun very playful and they, they're seeing only the perfect side of life for you. So they feel like, okay, well, I've been through this and I've been through that. They're overthinking the situation. They have more than trapped themselves here, but the divine's gonna force a meeting. So you will meet them anyway, okay? Then they'll act. Once they're with you in front of your face, they'll act. That's wonderful. King of Wands energy there. So. Um, although they're like this, sleeping at the moment, they will act. The minute they see you, they won't be able to hold back. This is um, love letters in her dress. So once they start, they won't stop. Very talkative, very good when we need good communicators. So I'm not uh, angry at that. We like people who talk and communicate, right? Ten of Wands, then everything just melts away. All this fear just melts away and then... It, you know, they've realized I've been worried about nothing. This person's awesome. Not only um, lighthearted and fun and playful, but very passionate and very deep and connected um, to source. So I feel like I really like that. It brings a lot of passion in for you here, singles. Um, justice. Um, they're not rushing to get married and you're not rushing to get married. So... <laughs> I feel like you've both been hurt, but you wear it a lot better than they have. So you might be in your glow up process. Um, so you're just wearing it a lot better than they do. So you're like, yes, they left me, but that was my blessing. I'm taking it. And this person is like, I'm scared of you. <laughs> so yeah, but they're really, really attracted to you and they will act on it. So I'm not overly concerned here. They're scared of being mistreated again. Um, but that was just something that they had to go through. We all do in life. I, I really like, I feel like, oh, for this person, but they will, they'll get this fire lit under them. Don't you worry. The divine will push them in your direction. Um, they're being slow to act. So this is why they're going to have the burden removed. They've had their chance to act, burden removed, cycle over, and the divine will now act and push you guys together. Six of pentacles. Um, the divine was pushing them more, but it might be that you end up starting the conversation with them uh, just to give them that extra confidence and that balance that what they're lacking in, you have in abundance here with the six of pentacles. Okay, the sun, here it is. And this is you answering, yes, yes, of course I want to give you my number. What are you talking about? I think you're great too. This person is really attractive, but doesn't know it. Um, so they've really had a number done on them in the past where, you know, they don't have that confidence to reach out and start a connection. There's nothing wrong with that, of course. Um, but we don't want to keep letting things pass us by and it's almost time for you two to meet. 
So the divine's like, look, you've had a lot of time here to act. I'm going to take that away from you. Ten of Wands, that's that cycle ending and closing down. They will have sown some karma during this time uh, with the justice. They're being unfair to themselves. They've been single, okay? So it's not that they're being unfair to another. They're being unfair to themselves. So they're sowing karma, okay? Um, let's see here. Uh, the hermit. So they've been through the dark night of the soul already. Um, they're not actually blaming an ex or something for what they went through, but they're just fearful. So they're like, okay, well, if I don't sell somebody, you know, if I don't meet somebody and I don't fall in love, I won't be hurt again. But that's not the case, is it? And that's what I mean by they're hurting themselves in this situation. So they go while this is being processed, the divine is setting up a meeting. They will go into hermit mode again. So they're not with somebody else. They're single. Um, and the divine's telling them, look, you're letting your life pass you by here. Act. Okay, I've got two decks mixed together here. Uh, the angel answers and the romance angels. Opportunity. Yeah, so they've, they're missing opportunities. We spoke about that, but... Yeah, it happens in readings, of course. Okay, so healing family issues. So rather than a relationship, it might have been a family situation that was held, holding them back. Don't stop there being told, and you're being told, Gemini, there's somebody better out there for you than, you know, you currently have your eyes on because you haven't seen them yet because they're too scared to act. You are ready for love, though. So that is a good, that is a bonus there. Compromise, and this is what the divine's bringing in, asking you to, you know, strike up a conversation so that you will, they will be brought into your presence and it's just much easier for you. Um, I feel like you have a lot of questions here for the divine, like, what's going on with, where's my romantic partner? Where's my soulmate? Where they are? Where they are? <laughs> I am a spirit having a human experience and I'm here to get closer to love. So that's what they need to realize. We're not supposed to shy away from love because of bad experiences. We're here to get closer to love, the divine. The key to prayer is prayer is to forget what I think I need. So don't have somebody in mind or, you know, oh, I need that sort of love. Because when you usually get that sort of love that you've seen on somebody else's profile or where they've posted goals, it's not actually um, the truth, right? Because people take a snapshot of time. And then in reality, they could be arguing behind the camera. So pray for what it is you will make you happy and make the other person happy in the relationship, not what you think you need. Okay, guys? Good luck.